Hi, welcome to online tutorial videos from JCPRO Labs. For more information, you can visit us at www.jcprolabs.org. You can also download the MATLAB code uh, for this video and for other videos from that web website and down from download section. So in this video, we'll talk about how to simulate fractional order transfer function or, or to get or how to get the step response of fractional order transfer function in MATLAB. So open MATLAB. In order to get the fractional order transfer function in MATLAB, we need to install one additional toolbox that is available from A Laboratories. Uh, and uh, you can download uh, that particular toolbox uh, from this website and this toolbox is formcon toolbox fractional order modeling and control if you search like uh, formcon download then any google link will um, uh, send you here so from this download section just click i agree the terms and condition and download version of the matlab once you have downloaded uh, this uh, form control box, you can extract uh, this form control box in any folder you want. Like uh, we have extracted it in MATLAB folder, form control box. Now you need to add uh, this particular toolbox uh, into your uh, MATLAB path. So, in order to do that, go to MATLAB and go here, go to set path and select this folder add with subfolders and go to the folder where you have pasted select it and then select folder then uh, that means all the folders will be done and then save and then close it so by doing this uh, you uh, in other sense you are installing this from control box to your computer so once you have installed so in order to see whether it has been installed successfully or not just type load set command in matlab and if it says all tests successfully loaded then the transfer the form control box has been installed and if we put this g1 so this will give you the transfer function so now uh, we will learn how to uh, these all are pre-made so we will learn how to define our own fractional order transfer function. So in this form control box, everything, most of the things are FOTF object, fractional order transfer function object. So unlike in MATLAB, uh, when we used to define or we transfer function, we used to create an object from TF command. In this case, we will create an object of FOTF type by typing s equals to fotf to s so this will create uh, s as an object type and then simply like matlab we can simply type of any transfer function of our choice like say uh, we have this transfer function s to the power 2.5 or s to the power 2 plus s to the power 1.5 plus s to the power 0 0.5 plus 3 so this will create a fractional order transfer function of our choice now there are several things like uh, we need to identify the step response of this transfer function and border plot or Nicholas plot so uh, commands are simple uh, for all those things for step response just type step and the system which you have just created and it will plot the step response of the system so the transfer function which we just created or fractional order transfer step response is something looks like this and it has oscillations there and similarly we can also plot the border plot of the system simply by typing body command and uh, it will give you a border plot of the system so let's close it and put it again so this is the border plot and similarly here it is the face plot so these commands are similar to that of the mat uh, built in matlab commands similarly nicholas nickfish plot okay 
And so this is an request plot for that transfer function. So uh, frequency response is also can be calculated from this body command. Please uh, return several values uh, of it. So all these things can be done uh, from here as well. So I hope you understand uh, how to define a fractional order transfer function and how to get sequence response and step response in MATLAB. In upcoming video, we'll talk about how to uh, how to define or uh, fractional order or how to design a fractional order PID controller in MATLAB using this form. So that's it for this video. Thank you.